This video will cover the topic, Greatest Common Factor of Three Univariate Monomials. What is the greatest common factor? The greatest common factor refers to the largest number that divides exactly into two or more other numbers. For example, if we have two numbers, 24 and 36, we make a list of the factors of each integer as follows. The greatest common factor of these two integers is 12. Since 12 is the largest number that divides evenly into both 24 and 36. Now we're going to learn how to find the greatest common factor of three monomials. We will start with the example problem. Find the greatest common factor of these three monomials. When looking for the greatest common factor, we start by listing the factors of the coefficients of each expression. Looking at the factors of each coefficient, we can see that the greatest common factor of these numbers is 8. Next, we will find the greatest common factor of the variables. We will factor x cubed so that we can see x cubed as a product of prime factors. This means x times x times x. Now we will factor x squared as a product of prime factors. This means x times x. Finally, we will also factor x to the fourth as a product of prime factors. The largest number of times that our three numbers have used x as a factor exists in x squared, where we see x times x. So the greatest common factor of these variables is x times x, or x squared. Combining these, we see that the greatest common factor of the monomials is 8x squared. I think I'm starting to understand, but what happens if there are no common factors for the coefficient of each expression? Great question. The common factor does not need to have both a coefficient and a variable. For our second example, let's find the greatest common factor of these three monomials. 21x cubed, 2x to the fifth, and 14x to the fourth. We start by listing the factors of the coefficients as follows. We see that the greatest common factor is just 1. Next, we list x cubed, x to the fourth, and x to the fifth as products of prime factors as we did previously. From this list, we can see that the greatest common factor is x times x times x, or x cubed. So the only factors the coefficients have in common is 1, but there are variables that the monomials do have in common. The greatest common factor of the three monomials is x cubed. All right, so first we need to list the factors of the coefficients of each monomial then we factor the variables of each monomial as a product of prime factors. Finally, we combine the greatest common factors for the coefficients and variables to find the greatest common factor of the three expressions. You got it!